Hello and welcome to Defect of the Month, brought to you by the NPL Defect Database. My name's Bob Willis and each month we'll look at process defects that you might see during manufacture. The Defect Database also gives you the opportunity of downloading all of the technical reports free of charge, which again picks up on some of the process defects we're discussing. It's unusual really to get wire corrosion these days, but it does occur. Now if you're soldering wire with insulation with multi-stranded cable, then you must not use a corrosive flux. What tends to happen is the flux actually capillaries up inside the stranded wire and it will sit there and not be detected. Corrosion can occur and then the wire can break due to flexure of the cable. Now it's not really possible to clean up inside a wire with multi-stranded terminations. So make sure you use an appropriate flux for this particular application.